Steve Harvey, men don't do anything for free. So, in a couple weeks, I'll be moving to California. I have a friend from high school who's LA? kind enough. Yes. Oh, okay. So, I have a friend from high school who's kind enough to let me stay at his place rent free. Excuse me. His place. He's just a friend, though. We've been friends rent since free. high school. Rent free. Oh, okay, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So. <laughs> I don't want to overstay my welcome. I'm definitely a little bit worried about that. <laughs> <laughs> but what if I do? Are there any signs, any hints I should look for? Yeah, first of all, let me explain something to you about guys. Okay. We're your friend only for one reason and one reason only. Because you have made it clear that this is all it is. So what we do is we hang around on the perimeter, circling, waiting on a crack in the door. As soon as we see a crack, guess what? Need a place to stay in LA? You stay in my place rent free. <laughs> you know the thing where like what guy friend does because I was in this position once when the woman complains about a boyfriend and everything He's doing wrong. He just takes a mental note of it like oh don't do that check that off <laughs> Oh, he does this. Okay, let's not do that And it just builds this like relation in but this not, close not thing always you could generally have No, you can generally have a guy as a friend uh, if I was a younger woman I'd rinse the guys for everything they can get if you know you're not gonna sleep with them But don't be colluded into the illusion that every guy is just gonna be your friend because most of them aren't and they only want one thing And of they'll do they anything do. to get what they can of course they do like that's a bad move I don't even think you have to worry yourself about overstaying your welcome. But if you wanna know if there's signs that it's time to go, well, you know, like if you walking down the street and you see a homeless person, they got your clothes on. That's... <laughs> what the hell is he doing with my top on? He didn't gave your stuff away. Okay. Hey, listen to me. Yes. You wanna go to LA, right? Yeah. Okay, then you're gonna go. Nothing I could say is gonna stop you. But just remember when you get out there, men don't do anything for free. Okay. Nothing. It's not how we make. You can have any guy in this room, man, if they were honest. Would you let a girl stay with you for free? <laughs> <laughs> sir, sir. He said no. With the white hair, would you let her? <laughs> no, no. This is a girl. You hear what he said? It doesn't work that way. Okay. I'm just telling you, that's you've got, you're a pretty girl. Don't. Thank you. Just stay, stay at the house. You're cool. <laughs> Chicago, okay. nice. It's going to be snowing in a minute. It's real nice. Thank you. What do you think? Do you think women should opt to be friends with guys or, or I think or a woman bay, doesn't you know, opt to be advice? friends with, with anybody to see what they can get out of them. Not, not at all. But, you know, if, they've been, if you're friends with someone for a really long time, surely that man's not doing it. Bro, I've heard stories of guys that I've, I've known friends that were f like in the friend zone for six, seven years. And then as soon as the boyfriend leaves, he goes, oh, I've been in love with you so the whole time. So he's literally been like hanging in there. Yeah, it's a bit sneaky to be honest. Oh yeah, there's a no go. Also, you cross that line, don't you? If you could ruin the, the relationship. I mean, there is there is cases where a woman will be friends with a guy. They're friends for a really long time. Then they end up dating, which is good. Because I recommend that for people as well. Before you get in a relationship, you should be friends and know each other first yeah. before you just start romantically yeah, 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 being yeah. infatuated. But I, I still think think it's not in a woman's best interest actually no I do I think it's a woman's best interest to keep guy friends around because she can get what she wants she can get him to pay for food she he, he can pick her up but she can get advice from him and she doesn't have to sleep with him I think it's not in a best interest for a man to have girlfriends if he's spending all his time and always yeah. giving time if, and it, if that's his only interest and that obviously his goal is to get with her then it's a pointless exercise then because yeah. it might never happen and you're wasting your time but she's not because she's getting what she wants out of it yeah, but she might just generally think she's just. That's got, what I'm saying. It's also it, that's what I'm saying. It's also deceptive. I think a lot of girls have to go through that phase though of learning. This guy tried to use me for this, and oh, he pretended to be nice. Because it's that thing of like serial killers can pretend to be nice because the idea of being nice is not tangible, so it, it, it can be fabricated. And so that's what guys will do. They'll fabricate being nice. It's not. It's not kindness. When a person is kind and they don't have to be, that's when it's genuine. I, I think women see it as like a, a defense mechanism as well. If a guy's really nice up front, you're like, whoa, what does he want? Why is he overly nice? There's there's yeah. an ulterior motive. I think sometimes... It's it, hard. It, it's, it can be quite cringy sometimes. Like, a woman wants a bad boy, don't it? Don't she? She wants someone that she can chase. Me, genuinely, I don't know if it's just because of me. Would you have guy friends? Do I have... No, I don't. Would you? If Would you entail in a... a I know a, guys that are friends, but I don't hang out with them. I don't get advice from them. But would you think it's in your best interest to have guy friends? friends that you hang out with completely platonically nothing else go out I mean, on dates talk to each other phone calls all that no because i can get that from my girls 
there you go. I, I'm not someone that uses people for the sake of it. I just think it's weird. I think if you have a girl that you're really interested in and you've been friends with her or, or, or you're just acquaintances for a long time, your best thing is to just say, look, I know we've been friends for a long time, but I've taken an interest to you and I'd like to take this relationship I further. Mean, can I take can you out on a date? And then got... if she says no, you have to cancel the friendship there because otherwise you're... You, you... If you've got a long going relationship as in friendship with a guy and you both get them feelings or one of them gets the feeling, I think it's best to be you honest. You have to be honest, yeah. But if a guy's just hanging around for years upon years or months upon months just so he can get in there, mm. like, get a life. It's a bit cringy. <laughs> <laughs> 